Are you tired of switching between ChatGPT, Stack Overflow and five different extensions just to write one block of code at a time? Perfect, because in this video we're diving into Augment Code, an AI coding assistant that helps you write, debug, refactor and understand code all in one place. No switching tabs, no extra fluff. And most importantly, Augment Code is a tool that gives developers superpowers, figuratively speaking. Whether you're a solo developer, part of a startup, or working deep in the trenches of a massive code base, Augment Code is built for experienced developers who need real speed and clarity at scale. It's fully compatible with VS Code, JetBrains, Vim, GitHub, and even Slack, so it fits right into the tools you already use. Recently, Augment Code introduced a powerful new feature AI agents. These agents handle even more of the heavy lifting, letting you delegate entire tasks, not just lines of code. And in this video, we're going to put that feature to the test. This is my first time exploring Augment Code, and the goal here is to give you an overview what this platform can do, how it works, and whether it's actually worth adding to your dev toolkit. Before I begin, I'd like to mention that you can try out this platform for free, free. There is no risk for you. And you can follow the link below and let's explore Augment Code together. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's not waste any more time. Let's dive deep. Installation is relatively simple, just go on augmentcode.com, click on install, just pick one of these options, I'm going to continue with Google. Once you create an account, you'll see three different options. These three extensions let you use the Augment tool inside your favorite code editor. If you're new to coding VS Code, this first option is the easiest and most beginner friendly. It's free, modern and supports many languages with tons of helpful extensions. JetBrains IDEs are more powerful and better for advanced or professional work, especially in languages like Java or Python, but they can feel heavier and are often paid. Vim is fast. It's a keyboard based editor that's great once you learn it, but it has a steep learning curve and isn't ideal deal for beginners. Most new developers will have the smoothest experience starting with VS Code, this first option. That's exactly what I'm going to click on. I have VS Code installed on my computer, so just install VS Code and open Visual Studio Code on your computer. This is what the editor looks like. The editor is open and we can see the welcome message from Augment Code. So VS Code is a third party editor developed by Microsoft and Augment is just an extension that you install into VS Code. The extension adds extra AI powered capabilities like chat based code help, smart completions and natural language editing, but it runs within the VS Code environment. So VS Code provides the base editor and Augment builds on top of it to enhance your workflow. I hope that makes sense. Once again, Augment helps developers write, understand, and improve code faster by offering natural language chat to explore code bases, intelligent code completions that consider your entire project, and the ability to generate or modify code using simple instructions, all directly within your editor. I'm going to create a new folder. I'm going to create a new file, new file. Let's click on Augment on the left sidebar. Let's try to create something. I'm going to ask Augment to help me create a simple weather app in JavaScript using the weatherapi.com API. I'm starting with absolutely nothing, just an empty folder, no code, and I see three different options here. Usually the default option is chat. We also have agent and agent auto. Chat mode is where you can talk to the AI like you would in any regular chat, ask questions, get help and have code related conversations. Then there is agent mode right here. This mode is more interactive. The AI can see what you're doing in real time, like your cursor movements and file changes and give you help based on what's actually happening in your editor. Finally, there is agent auto, which takes it a step further by offering suggestions automatically as you code without you having to ask. So in short, chat is 
for conversations and the agent modes are for hands-on in the moment assistance. Now I'm going to open augment and type one simple prompt in chat. I'm going to pick chat and this is my question. How can I create a weather app? Let's see what augment has to say. First let's create a new folder and the necessary files. Inside it will create two files. So the chat is designed to just provide answers. Now as I'm familiar with the process let's use a agent and create the app. Let's switch to agent. I'm going to select agent and um, I'm going to ask the agent to create a simple weather app in JavaScript for me. Let's click on enter. The agent is working. I can see something in the terminal on the right side of the screen. The agent is creating files. I now have index.html created. Now the agent is working on styles.css. So and yeah, as I mentioned, the agent opened the terminal for me and is now creating a simple weather app. It is gathering information and is working on the structure of the web application. In the editor, I can see all the suggestions and I can choose whether to accept or reject changes. I'm going to click on keep all. I'm going to open our index.html file just to see what the web application looks like. I'm going to use Chrome for that. Okay, so it's a simple looking app. I try to see how it works. Let's fix all the errors and I can simply request the agent to do it for me. In my case specifically, I just need to provide the agent with the API key. I just registered on weatherapi.com and obtained my free API key. I'm going to click on on copy. Now I have my API key and I'll share it with Augment. I'm just going to paste this API key, use this API key, enter, and the agent is updating the app.js file. Let's try to refresh the weather app page and see if the app is working now. New York, enter, perfect. All right. Two things. One, I love how fast the code is being updated. Normally to build something like this, you'd spend time setting up HTML, handling API calls, styling the page, debugging the fetch, logic, all of that. But with Augment, it's like having a senior developer next to you who just takes care of everything. This is what my weather app looks like. I've got an HTML page with an input box where I can type a city, some JavaScript that connects to the weather API. API and a basic layout that's clean and functional. Now I want to make it look a little better so I go back to Augment. This time around I'll be using Agent Odor, that third option. Let's see the difference. Switching to Agent Odor. Before I do that I'm going to manually approve all of the changes, keep all. Now I'll switch to Agent Odor. The first time I used Agent Odor I saw a notification with something like Agent Odor mode allows Augment to run commands automatically on your behalf without your explicit approval. Changes can be destructive, received with caution. You'll see something like this. To me this mode is even better because I don't need to approve anything manually. Everything will be automated. But again, received with caution. Let's go ahead and enter the prompt. Add some basic styling with the weather card layout and a nice background. Enter. The styling and the HTML structure are being updated. A loading animation was added. The UI is being enhanced. We even have the instructions on how to use the app. Open the index.html file in your browser. Enter a city. Click the search button. View the weather information. Let's do that. I'm going to refresh the page. It already looks way better than before. Miami. Search. Fetching data. Look at that. I love how fast it is and most importantly I did not have to improve anything on my end. I used a single prompt and now my web app is being updated. So now the app has a weather card with a soft background gradient and better fonts. It feels polished without me even touching a design tool. Also the background color is different. We can see clouds over the purple background. Love it. Here's where it gets interesting. I want to expand this app and hopefully the AI agent will will be able to handle it. 
add a five day forecast below the current weather. Enter. I'll add a five day forecast below the current weather. Let's start by updating our code to fetch and display the forecast data. All right, so the agent got it. Sometimes you maybe ask a question by the agent in the editor and you will have to clarify a few things so the agent can continue working. It's totally okay. The agent have successfully added a five day forecast to my weather app and let's test it. Let's take a look at it. Let's refresh this page. The app pulls in the right endpoints from the weather API, loops through the forecast data and adds little forecast blocks. Look at these blocks for each day. Let's make it look a little bit nicer. Improve the visual look of the app and fix this. Some of my images are not loading. I took a screenshot of it and I'm sharing this screenshot with the agent. Let's see if it manages to fix all the bugs. Look, it's now fixing the forecast icons as well. Let's refresh the page. Look at this. Look at this, all the icons are fixed now. No bugs to troubleshoot, it just works. Now the app shows not only today's weather, but also what's coming up for the rest of the week. It's a full feature that would take hours to build manually done in seconds. This is where Augment really shines. You're not stuck following tutorials line by line or copy pasting code you don't fully understand. You ask what you want, see how it's done and learn by doing. It's a game changer for beginners or anyone who just wants to move fast. So what are my thoughts on Augment code? I think that with the introduction of AI agent, this is now a powerful tool to create website applications without any knowledge of coding. If you've been thinking about making your first project or you're tired of setup getting in the way of ideas, this is probably the fastest and most fun way to build something real. All it takes is a prompt and this by far one of the best tools designed specifically for coding. That means coding gets fast and easy with minimal errors. Augment understands your code and the structure of your project and it's important. It understands the structure and based on that it makes much smarter decisions where you need adjustments. Augment is perfect for working with large code bases. It looks at your entire code and generates responses based on the full context full context. With Augment you don't need to explain everything. It just reads and understands your code and only then gives you outputs based on a complete understanding of your needs. It's significantly more intelligent than alternatives and it's a big game changer in the dev world. And you don't need to take my word for it. Take the free trial and test this incredible tool or should I say set of tools. I'm pretty sure you'll love it. If you have any questions or suggestions, shoot them in the comment section. I'm done for now. I'll talk to you soon. Ivan KV out.